The Chinese are building a blue water navy to rival the U.S. Navy. They're doing it by stealing American technology developed over years and at great cost. The Chinese have laid claim to the South and East China Seas, challenging us and our Pacific allies from Japan and Korea to the nations of Southeast Asia. America's economy, as well as the economy of our allies, requires free and unfettered access to trade traveling by sea. Well, the president is now in China, where he's been referred to as a lame duck president of a has-been nation. The entire nation's well-being and security depends on a strong American military, especially a strong American Navy to operate and train in the Pacific. Well, it not only allows us to be prepared to defend our freedom, it shows the world that America is willing to defend our freedom. The American armed forces, and especially the Navy, go to extraordinary lengths to perform their essential duties while at the same time protecting the environment. No other military in the world goes to those lengths. Most of our adversaries, they wouldn't even consider doing it. But some radical environmentalists have threatened to file suits against the United States Navy to stop training and exercise. Well, if they succeed and the Navy cannot train adequately and therefore jeopardize the Navy's ability to protect Americans, you've got to scratch your head. Just who do the radical environmentalists think is going to protect them?